Haha, <laughs> I forgot my name. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to Korean Weekly Words. I'm Jae Hui, and let's see what we have for this week. This week's theme is. What? <laughs> crossing borders. Uh, crossing borders. Let's see what we have. Okay, the first word is. Kukjok, which means nationality. The country where you belong to. When you get on the airplane and, you know, when you talk in Korean and the other person will ask you, you know, 국적이 무엇입니까? Which means, what is your nationality? Okay, next we have 세관, which means customs. Okay, with the word you can say, 저는 세관을 통과할 때마다 긴장합니다. Which means, I feel nervous whenever I go through customs. I don't know, I don't purchase anything expensive, but I just feel like, you know, I'm doing something wrong when I go through customs. 여권, which means passport. 여 means traveling. Guan means book. So it literally means books for traveling that you have to get. So, with the word you can say, 여권을 잃어버려서 대사관에 갔습니다. Which means, I lost my passport, so I went to the embassy. No, I didn't. Yeah. <laughs> okay, next we have, 비자, which means visa. With the word you can say, 한국 여권으로는 비자 없이 갈수 있는 나라가 많이 있습니다. Which means with a Korean passport, you can visit a lot of countries without a visa. Okay, next we have. It's getting difficult. 세관 신고서, which means declaration form. You can say, 저는 비행기를 타기 전에 미리 세관 신고서를 씁니다. Which means I fill in the decor <laughs> declaration. <laughs> yeah. Which means I fill in declaration form before I take a flight. Okay, next we have end. Okay, that's all. <laughs> Outro is the most difficult. Okay, that's all for this week. Um, I will see you next time. 다음 시간에 뵙겠습니다. 안녕히 계세요.